United Comics Universe. A universe for fans. From pages to pictures, we are comics. Iron Man 3 writer theorizes Marvel Studios' WandaVision will introduce mutants. That's an article by Cameron Bonomolo. This was on August the 16th. Fresh. 100% fresh. The article continues to say Iron Man 3 screenwriter Drew Parse suspects Marvel Studios will use Disney Plus series WandaVision to introduce mutants into the Marvel Cinematic Universe. I would definitely not be surprised if WandaVision is on the way they start to bring in, for example, mutants, Pierce told Collider. When talk turned Disney's streaming service, future home to multiple MCU set series intertwined with the movie side of the Kevin Feige steered franchise. WandaVision reuniting Avengers stars Elizabeth Olsen and Paul Bettany as Scarlet Witch and Vision respectively. Marvel Studios will launch the Falcon and Winter Soldier pinning, spinning out of, con of Captain America Civil War and Avengers in game with Anthony Mackie and Sebastian Stan, Hawkeye with Jeremy Renner and Loki with the Tom Hiddleston back as the time-traveling trickster demigod. Set some time after Endgame, WandaVision will act as a direct tie-in to Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness, where Olsen joins Benedict Cumberbatch in what has been described as MCU's first scary movie. Though Feige made no mention of WandaVision incorporating mutants during Marvel's Phase 4 unveiling, as San Diego Comic-Con Feige only referenced recently acquired properties X-Men and Fantastic Four when saying there wasn't enough time to discuss mutants or Marvel's first family Scarlet Witch is a character with deep ties to X-Men lore. In Marvel Comics Scarlet Witch was originally depicted as a mutant and once transformed the Marvel Universe into a reality where Homo Superior ruled supreme after her fantasized domestic life where she started an idyllic family and lover vision was ripped away. Scarlet Witch later famously uttered, no more mutants. When ending the House of M event, causing the mass depowering of much of the world's mutant population, Feige has not hinted how the MCU will handle its approach to mutants. In an April interview following Disney's acquisition of 20th Century Fox in March, Feige said the X-Men won't enter the MCU for a very long time. Ah, that's sad to hear, but I think that's a necessary thing, a necessary part of the process to bring in the X-Men in the way they were intended to be in. But that's me, Joan and Show. It'll be a while. It's just beginning and the five year plan that we've been working on, we were working on before any of that was set, Fage said, of the then an unannounced phase four, which includes Black Widow, Eternals, and Shang-Chi, three films I'm very excited about. So really, it's much more for us, less about specifics of when and where the X-Men will appear. Right now, more just the comfort factor and how nice it is that they're home. That they're all back, but it will be a very long time. That comment seems to rule out the long in the works WandaVision involving mutants, at least in any extensive capacity. But as theorized by comicbook.com, the six-episode series could lay the groundwork for an MCU spin on House of M, or in the future, do the heavy lifting to integrate mutants into an MCU where they've yet to be seen or mentioned. Marvel's Disney Plus series will intersect with the movies in a very big way, opening up a totally new form of storytelling that will get to play with an explore. Totally new form of storytelling that we get to play with an explore. Feige previously told Variety, It's the first long time narrative that Marvel Studios has done. There'll be six episodes, eight episodes, ten episodes with the actors from the films playing their characters. They'll be changing, evolving, growing in those event series, and then those changes will be reflected in their first, uh, excuse me, their next film appearances. WandaVision premieres on Disney Plus in spring. 2021 I'd say get your subscription as soon as you can but we all know it's like a drug 
How about get your prescriptions? WandaVision, can't wait for it. Spring 2021, Disney Plus, be there or be lost.